we're still at the CCA workbench, man. If people only knew what we were talking about during commercial breaks, that's the best part when you have live audiences. You had to clean up your act, Dave. <laughs> I don't All know. right, where are we starting tonight? With we're going to start with the Starbright because it's in your hand. The Starbright Ultimate Boat Guard. It's a speed detailer. It's a, you know, like a speed wax. You know, it's in between the time when you really want to polish it all up. You know, if you want to just put a little quick uh, detail to it, the Ultimate Boat Guard is the one you want to use. It cleans, it adds a shine, and you know, enhances your color. Uh, you just spray it on, or and you know, wipe it on until it's a haze, a little 18 by 18 inch area, until it hazes up, and then buff it off, and then you're shiny, shiny. It works good. Colored. The color. key to this, though, I've used it a lot. Is you gotta let it haze. You gotta up. let it dry up, just like a good wax. You know, on a humid day, it takes a little longer takes, than two minutes. Yeah, Where do you right. go to get it? Starbright.com. Okay. All right. Next, we got some live bait, live target swim baits. We were talking about snook earlier. You know, uh, I was actually using a little croaker version of one of these earlier today. It was the one you were putting the hook in. Yes. But uh, these things are great because you know they, they have a nice profile. They look a lot like the fish that they're supposed to look like. The mullet and the pilcher and that little. Croaker, they, they just look just like they're supposed to look. And that kick and tail, you know, makes them look alive. They've got a little doodad on the top that kind of is a weed guard for the big hook they got in there. Mm -hmm. And, uh, you know, go to livetarget.com and get a swim bait because, you know, you can work those on the bottom or, you know, they come in different sizes and, and uh, weights as well. <clears throat> so Now we got some R&Rs. Yes, sir. Those are some of the Ray's favorite uh, Sabiki rigs, if you're going to be, you know, like we're talking about snook, they love live baits and everything loves live baits. And if you want to catch live baits, it's hard to beat a Sabiki rig. And Ray makes the best at r, &R Tackle. Uh, these, the little ones here are, are the fluorocarbon ones and they're made to catch little sardines and pilchards and little baits like that. Uh, they got a 10 pound main line with a six pound branch. And you can see they got little green or red heads. And you can get all red heads if you want, or all green if you want. But Ray likes that one because it's got a little mixture of both. So he doesn't know what they're going to be eating. The bigger ones there are made for goggle eyes. <clears throat> and they even make some bigger ones over there for tunas and whatnot. And they've got, you know, a 40-pound uh, main line with a 20-pound branches. And all the fish skins on there are real glow-in-the-dark fish skins too, so they work really good when they're when they're deep. So tell me about the D hooker. There's a D hooker recommendation. Well, it, yeah, exactly. On every one of these packs, it has a D hooker re recommendation, either a small or medium or a large. And if you don't use the proper D hooker with the proper diameter and that curve right there it can mess up the mouth of the bait. It crushes their mouth instead of actually just pulling the hook out. Right. So it's imperative that you use the right D hooker and Ray supp supplies all those as and well. And where do we find all this, Dave? Well, that's rnrtackle.com. Okay. I mean, if you want to do that. All right, next we got some Gill uh, UV, the new tech hoodie that they've got. It's a, <clears throat> uh, Gill's been making uh, offshore gear for sailboat fellas for quite some time. And this is an ultra lightweight, you know, when you feel these things, they're, it's like, you know, gossamer. It's very, very, very light stuff. It dries quickly. It's a moisture wicking. Uh, you know, UPF 50 is what's the, the big deal with this, this uh, tech material. Very, very uh, sun protective. And you, you know, put the hoodie on and you're, and you're all set. And they, you know, they got men's and ladies and all That's different That's the ladies sizes. I picked up, obviously. Right, that was right. a little skinny girl right and uh, plus they come with a thumb lock as well so you can put your thumb in there and get the, get it over your hand mm -hmm. which i like to do i used, <coughs> used to cut these things in my shirts and now you don't have to do that but uh gillmarine.com nice stuff it is very nice and they also they also make uh you know they have a new website called gillfishing.com so you can go there okay and get some of that last last but not least we got some artwork from courtney marie martin she and Ohana Creations, if you go to ohanacreations.com, you can see all of Courtney's art. She does uh, some really cool Hawaiian style art and, you know, Polynesian style. And she also does, you know, more realistic stuff. And she paints furniture. <clears throat> she makes, you know, art for the walls or mailboxes. You know, she just does it incredible. And I love these decals. Kingfisher is my favorite bird, so that's why I had to buy that. You're fond of that sticker, are you? I am very fond of this sticker. Yes, okay. I am. But go to ohanacreations.com and see Courtney's art. She's a and great girl. Ohana uh, means family. Yes, it does. And family means nobody gets left behind. There you go. Lilo and Stitch oh, coming boy, at you. Oh, that's ya. sweet.